Hi everyone, today we are going to be doing a back to school makeup tutorial and I am going to be using all drugstore products if you guys want to buy my dog's outside. <laughs> Can you hear his breathing? Probably. Uh, well, back back to uh, back to what I was talking about. Uh, he's in my window like uh, open me the door page. Uh. Anyway, as I was saying, I am going to be using all drugstore products and I am going to be doing a quick and easy makeup tutorial like it's going to be natural because I know most of us in the morning don't want to wake up an hour before and do a full beat <laughs> unless you're like me on Fridays. I used to wake up on Fridays like two hours before like at three in the morning and do like a full beat. I'm like, who is this girl? And then... Monday to Thursday, I was like dead. I didn't even put like mascara. <laughs> I was like, yeah, that's me. Foundation. Anyway, this is going to be a 10 minute, 15 minute tops tutorial. Because you could do this every day in the morning, hopefully. I hope you guys like it. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications so you can get a notification every time I post. Let's get started. For primer today, I am going to be using this e.l.f. primer and it has no label or anything. It just says e.l.f. and I will be putting the name below so you guys could get it or like look it up and then buy it in your drugstore. I am literally out of this because I used to use it a lot. For foundation, I am going to be using my Wet n Wild foundation. And I wasn't going to use foundation, but I do have a lot of pimples right here, as you can tell. And I don't want, I want to cover that up. This is like a medium coverage foundation because I don't want a full coverage foundation. And I'm going to be using this beauty blender. And I bought this in the drugstore too. Uh, it's about 7 to $8. And I'm just going to blend on my foundation now if you don't have as much acne as i have i do right now you could just skip the foundation part and just go right with concealer this is my maybelline concealer and it's in fit me i will be putting a little bit i will be blending it with the same beauty blender next to put powder on my face I am going to be using the Fit Me uh, Loose Powder by Maybelline and I am going to be using a dry beauty blender if you don't have a dry one or another beauty blender just use the same one but I just like using a dry one please do not skip this um, step if you do your face is going to be cakey for the whole day after like the two or three hours if you have any leftover powder just take it off with a little brush for bronzer i am gonna be using my butter bronzer this is about seven or eight dollars and instead of using falsies i am just gonna put mascara i'm gonna use my colorless mascara So I did clean up my lips because they have foundation on them and they are pinkish, reddish and I will usually just go like this to school. But if your lips are not pinkish or reddish, I am going to be putting a lipstick and this is the Maybelline lipstick and this is in color Nude Lust. could go like this to school and it'll be done but if you are like me and you have a little bit of more time I am gonna add two more steps and I'm gonna do my eyebrows and put some highlighter on I am gonna be using this gel for my eyebrows this was about two dollars but I bought it a long time ago so I'm not sure where you could buy it but if you have your own you could use that one or you could buy one from the drugstore I know the next ones are really good Instead of doing a full bead eyebrow that I always do, I am just going to fill in my eyebrow. I am not going to put all the product all the way in the front. I am going to get my little brush and I am just going to diffuse 
so the product could go into the front but it could be lighter like that and then with your finger you could just go like this <laughs> finally for highlighter I am gonna be using the wet and wild highlighter and this is in color precious petals You want to put just a little bit of this because you don't want an intense highlighter and then you have a light makeup. This is the final look. I hope you guys like it. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications. I'll see you guys on Sunday.